Well, good afternoon. Today is Tuesday. Hi, my name's Tiffany, and this summer I'll be working and living in Blind Channel, a remote community on West Thurlow Island, complete with a marina, store, restaurant, and more. Come along and join the adventure. It's my second to last day, I think. <laughs> and it's been, I wouldn't say busy, but I've had customers this morning for sure. And um, there are boats. <laughs> there are one, two, three, four boats still on the dock. Uh, one is leaving for sure. The other ones I have no idea. I mean, I thought they were leaving, but they're still here, so who knows. I'm a little bit tired. I didn't sleep great last night. I, um, had a dream that my alarm didn't go off, and then I was late waking up, and it wasn't great, but we're here. I'm still doing my lovely data entry gig. I have this much remaining. So it's not that much at all, and honestly, if I just sat here and did it, it wouldn't take me too long, but I'm not in the mood to work today, <laughs> so it's been a little bit of a challenge, but it is what it is. I am here and um, doing stuff. <laughs> I don't even know. It's um, 12.20 and um, just, you know, texting with my boss from the theater, just getting everything organized for my return. Uh, I was texting with my replacement from the summer yesterday and she's like, oh, I'll just bring my keys back. And I was like, don't bring your keys back. I think we want you to stay on and talk to the boss. And so she agreed to stay on as relief if we need her for extra help. So that is fantastic. Um, and that'll also, I think, give me a bit more flexibility if I need to come out here and stuff. And then just also so I don't have to work seven days a week sometimes. But yeah, that's right. God, I look like a zombie. And I feel like it too. Anyways, back to work, get this done, and then I don't know what I'm gonna do. So there's this thing called Connected Coast that's coming along. And so we're hoping next year that we will have fiber optic here, which would be awesome. Internet would be so much better. And I suggested at that point, it's not a beer, I promise, <laughs> that we upgrade the doorbell here to a Nest doorbell. That way anybody can log in on their phone who has access to it. The doorbell rings and go, hey, I'm coming. Because today, since I got back from my break at like three, I've seen one person twice and that's it. I sat there for a long time. I watered the plants and now I'm back to sitting. I got this to try to wake myself up because oh my goodness, I am tired. And like, there's nothing to do. If I were taking my scrunchies, you can't wear a disease gear. If I was taking them with me, I'd be doing that, but I'm not gonna take them until I come back, so I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm just extremely bored. And like, like this I can't do anything with. The shirts are mostly folded. It looks like I can do a little bit of organizing on here, but again, not too much. That's pretty good. Oh, oh, wait. Let me put that down there. Somebody bought that. Oh, thank God. That's fixed now. We're good. Okay, so. Oh, wait. There's some coffee, too. Somebody bought some coffee. I remember this. This was one of my challenging customers. Eh. Okay. Oh, wait. I think that's that. Yeah. Okay. Eh. All right. Are we good? Yeah. Like, we're... Oh, oh mayonnaise, too. <laughs> it's just... It's just, it's all so good looking because I've been bored for days. Ugh. Anyways, I do have one ambitious thing I can do, which is over here. So, this wine here, I sold one today, so I can get one more to go in the back. But, naturally, it's in this box. So, I mean, I can do that. But then, maybe... Oh, you know what? I can pull that out and slide it out. Okay, I, I found a few things to do. But just keep in mind that I have another day of this. <laughs> this is why they don't have storekeepers year round. Because like... Alrighty, so it is like 9 o'clock and I've been pretty slacky. But I've made a little bit of progress. So I now have two bags packed with clothes. Um, I have... These clothes here, I'm gonna wear these and 
this out on Thursday morning. Go there. I'm going to wear this and this tomorrow with a hoodie. So everything else can pack, including like all these socks and stuff here. I think everything else is empty, if I recall. Excellent. Okay. So I just have that drawer there and then all the tech stuff here. Oh, and then like oh, all that. But it's coming along. I'm feeling a lot better about things now and less stressed and it should be fine. So I have one more of those large Ziploc space saving bags. So I'm going to, I think, try to get that packed tonight with the rest of my clothes. Save my PJs and what I've pulled out and like my embroidery fabric and stuff. And then I'm not gonna vacuum it because people are like already into bed. Um, like just, <laughs> but I've got like a mess going on over here. Shocking. Um, <laughs> but if I get it ready, then I think that will be good. Yeah, it's coming along. We'll see how things go, but I feel like I have lots of space, um, but we'll see. I don't know, man, we'll, we won't know until we know, but that's the plan for tonight is to get as much as I can of that packed up and um, go from there. We can listen to some music or maybe a audiobook and um, do as much as we can. I still have tomorrow, um, but tick, 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 talk, 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 tick, tock, tick, tock. That's the word I was going for. Time is running out, but it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Good morning. It is a beautiful day of torrential downpour and naturally I packed my rain boots and my rain pants. Probably won't wear them anyways, but rain boots. They are <sighs> at the very bottom of this, so that's not happening. I think it'd be one thing if I had to work outside, but I just have to get to the store. My blundstones will be good enough for that. I got quite a bit done last night, honestly. Every single drawer is empty and almost everything is packed except for these things here. I mean, the stuff that I'm wearing tomorrow and also my, whatchamacallit, my Ronin, which I did not learn how to use this summer because I just didn't have time. And then this, besides that, everything else is packed. Down there is just an extra bag, my two coolers, and my backpack to put more things in. And then like, I guess that stuff too, <coughs> excuse me, is not packed, but you know, we're almost there. So that is very exciting. I'm less excited about this rain, and I think it's supposed to rain tomorrow too, so <sighs> my plan had been to bring my stuff down and put it in the fuel shed tonight, at least the majority of it, like the two totes, but now I don't know, we'll see. Anyways, I'm getting ready for work. It is currently 8.40, so I just gotta put on a couple more layers and grab my pens and stuff, and I think I'm good to go. Um, and then it's gonna be probably another boring day of sitting in the store. I might have to do some housekeeping today, keys, um, but I'm not sure because it depends on if they just decide to wait until tomorrow when there's a boat that can bring the housekeeper over because she lives kind of around the corner and can't clean here if, if our boats don't pick her up because her boat is currently broken. So there's that. Kniffy. <laughs> Did I, ever, I, I got my friend to bring me a knife because I have like this thing that I keep all my blind channel stuff in. And um, I thought I had a knife in it and I didn't. So I got my friend to buy a knife and bring it in for me. I paid him back. And then like before he came back in the next time, I had lost it and I was like, it was in a pair of uh, shorts in the pockets, but yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna finish getting ready and I will see you down at the store, which hopefully isn't flooding from the rain. I can see the hole that we had to dig here because there was sewage issues. I don't even know if I mentioned it. There was a septic issue, had to dig a big hole, divert a pipe. It's fine, 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 fine. Anyways, water's pooling on top of that. So that's not ideal, but anyways, I'll check it with you in the store. Alrighty, it is 11.30 and there's a strudel over there wandering about, being all sad, and there are no boats on the dock. The only boat on the dock is the Share Bear because all our water taxis are out as well. It's crazy. <laughs> I actually had a pretty steady morning from like, basically when I opened until, I'd say like 10.30, maybe 11, with people checking out and I had some work to do, 
learning to post bills and stuff and doing some inventory so that was exciting but now we're like at the we're at the nothing there is a tour group coming in will this work that is way too low nope that will not work there's a tour group coming in um to walk the trail and do lunch so there's that and then there's um a cabin checking in later that's all we know about is there any more coming i don't know but do you see a sad strudel Hello, my love. Hello. Yeah. Now we have the barge over there fueling us and propane and all that fun stuff. And then I think we've got the mail plane about to come in. We just saw one go overhead. I can hear something. Should be coming around the corner any second. There it is. very not busy but kind of busy so I think these guys are gonna have to move maybe I don't know it'll be interesting to see how they make this happen <laughs> because all of our uh, docks here all the fingers have poles so yeah should be should be interesting windows wide the curtains fly to catch the evening breeze Without you here to keep me warm Believe I'd rather freeze Believe I'd rather freeze We've got a boat that just came in, just showed up, didn't radio in. It's a cat. Cats are massive. We don't put them in between because they're so beamy and I don't know what's going on. Maybe they want fuel. Maybe they want to stay for the night. Who knows? You know why we don't know? Because they didn't radio in. Uh, it's like... Hello, we're here. Let us tell you where to go. Tell us what you're trying to do. I'm the only thing I'm thinking is maybe they want fuel, but they can't get to the fuel dock because the barge is still on it, fueling us. So maybe that's what it is. I don't know, people. Anyways, it is currently 1:22, and um, hello. Hi. Oh my goodness, have things changed? Also, my nose ring keeps. The piercing keeps turning and it's super annoying. Anyways, one of our boats is having a transmission issue, so my boss is going to go tow it back here. And then, which throws a wrench in the plan for me leaving tomorrow just for boats lining up. And then the trip I was supposed to leave on is canceled, I believe, so... Do I just live here now? I don't know, man. Like, things are just not working out for me coming out and going home, and so TBD on departure day, but if it's after today, then I will definitely have to um, unpack some clothes. Or like if it's not tomorrow because I, I packed everything. Also, there are so many bugs in the store. I'm gonna try to murder some of them. We have um, a lovely one of these. So murdering time is about to commence. Got him. We're right there. I got him. It's not gonna focus, but I got him. I swept. I mopped. I sat and did nothing for a while. And um, I organized the scrunchies. I think there's a couple shirts that I can fold. And uh, it's looking like it's not a tomorrow departure. Still don't know for sure, gotta wait till my boss gets back to figure everything out, but maybe Friday, if we go to town on Friday, which was what my initial plan was, or maybe Saturday because the people from the share bear are going to town, so there's that. I have one frozen cinnamon bun left, good to know. Anyways, I think I can do a little bit 
through here. Like there's one shirt, two shirts, <laughs> and I can probably hang a couple because I did sell some. So maybe something to do, but honestly, there's just not much to do these days. And um, oh wait, oh, sold that. We'll face that. I know that all came at the same time, so that's fine. We FIFO'd. Um, I sold something else. Maybe it was this. We'll just tuck that. <laughs> How riveting is this? But this is honestly what my day has been. There we go. Face that salmon. What is going on here? Manual focus. What you doing? What you doing? There we go. Okay, so anything else? I sold, oh, I sold soap. I remember that was the other thing. <laughs> Face that. Um, yeah, oh, I can actually refill this a bit. I can refill the Coke, because that's quite low. Um, and face this, and refill some of the Snapple. And some beer, and some beer. Okay, there are some things to do, which is really exciting, because, like, duh, There's people staying in that cabin there. <laughs> and then if we go all the way over here, do 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 there is one boat right there. The people that came in on the cat were actually really nice and they bought a bunch of books, so that was cool. But yeah, so I'm gonna spend a little bit of time doing those things I just found. And um, it's currently, let's see, what time is it? It is currently a quarter after five, so we're getting near the end. 45 minutes left to go. And then I'm gonna go home and cook myself a steak and figure out if I need to unpack some clothes. <laughs> and um, yeah go from there. Well, hello and good evening. Um, I did no packing today. I didn't do anything. I ate a wonderful steak dinner, which was to be my last dinner in Blind Channel. <sighs> and I'm not going home tomorrow. <laughs> so, uh, well, I'm really having an allergy issue as well right now. So, as I mentioned earlier, boat was having, I think I said it broke down, so I think it's a transmission issue. So, that needs to go to town. So, that's out of commission, but the run that I was supposed to be on was cancelled. So I was like, well, I guess I'm stuck here. But then the run was uncancelled. Oh, I'm so stuffed up. And um, so I was like, oh, maybe still going, but I don't think so because timing won't work out because of missing the one boat. And then my one boss came in tonight and he was asking me about um, some guests that had come in. And then I was like, yeah. Um, so I guess I'm not going tomorrow. He's like, you were supposed to be going tomorrow because like the lack of communication out here sometimes is just in insanely phenomenal. Anyway, so he was like, well, no, because the boat's going to town tonight. So there is a tide change at like midnight that they need to hit. And so him and Strudel's mom are going to town tonight. They're going to spend the night. They have to do the haul out at six in the morning um, to get it to the mechanic. And then Strudel's mom is going to do that run that got canceled and then rebooked. And then there's just, there's no chance to get home. <laughs> but Strudel's mom said she's going to town either Friday or Saturday and she promised to smuggle me out. So either Friday or Saturday, but that means I may need to unpack my shower stuff and shower. Probably should have showered tonight, to be honest, but I thought I was leaving tomorrow and then I just got lazy. Um, so I'll probably, so I'll probably need to do that. And then I'll probably also need to unpack one of my Ziploc bags to find some more socks. I have socks for tomorrow, but after that, not so much. <laughs> so that's where we're at. Um, it is currently a time. It is, um, 9.25. Um, I, my, my boss texted me and was like, my other boss, and he was like, oh, um, so the trip is back on tomorrow. You can go at 6.45. And I was like, no, they're going tonight. So I was like, nope, I'll be back in the store at 9 a.m. like usual. So I'll be there tomorrow. We'll find something to do with, uh, hopefully, and, um, yeah, I think I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go look for short dated items so they know what they need to pull. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do with the rest of my time. But it is what it is. Anyways, I'm suffering. 
I took allergy medicine, but it has not kicked in yet. I think it was a wet strudel or perhaps a wet Millie. And oh my God, it's so funny. So Millie is my boss's dog and Millie's not allowed on the couch. But when Millie comes to visit us, we let her on the couch. <laughs> And so she comes in with him and it's like, ooh, couch. And he's like, no, you're not allowed on the couch. You know better than that. And me and the dock attendant are just like, do, 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 do. how could you have ever learned that? They never told her us not to let her on the couch. So we just let her on the couch. Anyways, I'm dying. <laughs> I'm gonna um, plug my laptop in and I'm just gonna lay down and I'm gonna go to sleep. And then tomorrow's another day and maybe I'll leave and maybe I won't and maybe I vlog, I'll vlog and maybe I won't. I don't know, but for now, <laughs> thanks for um, coming along on this journey of uncertainty with me and I'll see you next time. <laughs>